Hi, I'm Heidi Dickerson. Welcome to LVI TV, your weekly dental news source. What's important to note this April? April Fool's Day, National Walk to Work Day, my birthday, Palm Sunday, Passover, Income Taxes Due Date, Good Friday, Easter Sunday, Patriots Day, Earth Day, Administrative Professionals Day, formerly Secretary's Day, Take Your Daughter to Work Day, Arbor Day, Spring Break, but that's not all. April is National Facial Protection Month. What? You've never heard of this? The ADA, American Association of Orthodontics, the American Association of Oral and Maxillofacial Surgeons, the American Academy of Pediatric Dentistry, and the American Academy for Sports Dentistry all support National Facial Protection Month, as do we at LVI. According to Dr. Eric Geist, every year about 3 million people are treated in emergency departments across the United States for facial trauma injuries. He says these may include injuries to the skin, jaw, nose, eye, socket, or teeth, and other areas of the head and neck. So who's at risk? Well, just about anyone who's active. Spring seems to get us all out and moving again. Spring sports kick into gear, and along with this comes injuries. As dentists, we should ask our patients what sports they are involved in. Promote safety by encouraging helmet wearing, protective guards, and eyewear. And most of all, let's protect those teeth with some mouth guards. Mouth guards will not only help with mouth and jaw injuries, but prevent concussions as well. Done in the neuromuscular position, they can also increase strength and agility. Who better than you to make a custom guard that is protective and comfortable and increases performance? Do you have ideas on how to promote National Facial Protection Month in your office? We'd love to hear your ideas below. Don't forget to like us and subscribe, and we'll see you next time on LVI TV.